Hey everyone, let's take a look at this absolutely perfect pristine white metallic 2023 Lincoln Aviator in the 201A reserve package. This one is loaded with goodies. Let's check it out. So underneath the hood is the powerful twin turbo V6. Puts out 400 horsepower. This thing can move. It's actually still pretty good on fuel thanks to its 10 speed transmission. You do also have these awesome fully automatic set it and forget it LED headlights, including auto high beams and LED fog lights. You also have a nice around view camera system, one in the front, the back, and under both mirrors to help you park. To go with that, you do have front park sensors in the front bumper. That helps you not run over your kid's bike or anything else in the parking lot. The vehicle also has a forward collision system with pedestrian detection. So if some little one walks out in front of this car, it will apply the brakes that saves lives and saves you a little bit of money on insurance, which is nice. As we come alongside the vehicle, you do have these beautiful 20 inch wheels. You also see the word aviator on the side here. That's the only place you'll see that as the vehicle is practically debadged. The mirrors are nice black, gives a great contrast to the white. Mirrors have an LED light in them. They also have a blind spot monitoring system right here. They are a power heated mirror. That's also power folding and memory. To get in or out of this vehicle, you can just put your code inside here and unlock it. You can also put your hand inside the door handle. It'll sense the heat from your hand and unlock. Or you can use this key fob right here with unlock, lock, remote start, power lift gate, and alarm. The vehicle also comes with an app called Lincoln Way. It's totally free and you can unlock or remote start your vehicle from anywhere in the world. You can also use your phone as a key, meaning you don't need to use this at all. You just walk up with your smartphone and the vehicle will unlock and start as long as you have your phone. As we come to the back, I'd like to show these handles are quite nice. They don't move at all. There's actually a little sensor inside that you pull. As we open up the back of this, you get a look at this beautiful interior. I love this. This is the ebony roast interior. I love the contrast of these speaker covers and the piano black finish. You've got nice visors on the back. Keep the sun off little ones if you'd like. This also has the Revel Ultima stereo system, a beautifully sounding system. Seats in the back is the captain's chairs configuration. You can see they can both move forward and back on their own if you'd like. The leather on here is Bridge of Wear leather. This is some of the finest crafted leather in the world made in the Highlands of Scotland. You'll only find it in Lincoln's, Lear's Jets and Rolls Royce. This also has the full console upgrade in the back. So this console lets you throw things in, cup holders as well as controls the power shade up top. These leather seats are not only heated, but they are also cooled and you can control all that from a little display back here. Also lets you control the climate and the stereo system. You have USB and full inverted power supply. Got some nice all weather mats there. Look up top and you'll see that huge panoramic roof with power shade, letting in lots of natural light. As we come to the back of the vehicle, rear park sensors, and some of these sensors actually help park the vehicle for you. That's right, this big beautiful beast can parallel park itself. Quad tipped exhaust looks great. Underneath that little piece of plastic there is a tow hitch. This vehicle is able to pull 5,600 pounds. When we hit the unlock button on the key fob, opens up this power lift gate. And you can see we have just a ton of cargo space back here, which is awesome. Now these seats do fold up if you want, and you do have another bit of storage underneath here, which is really nice. You can just hit this button right here, and those seats will power fold up for you. This is also a really nice way to take a look at this full interior. Gosh, that's gorgeous. Let's go to the front and check out some of those features. As we open up the driver's door, more of those beautiful stereo speaker covers. You've got memory seating, controls for all your seat. That's right, all of your seat controls are up here. And these are 28 way perfect position seats. We're gonna talk about more of those in a second. You've got power locks, power folding mirrors and power windows. And you get in the word Lincoln lights up. On the dash, you've got beautiful trim here, real wood inlay. And then we've got some controls for your lights, interior dimming and your power hatch power tilt and telescopic steering wheel and then these gorgeous 28 way perfect position seats again with that bridge of wear leather heated cooled and massaging what let's climb inside okay now that we're in the vehicle we're just going to hit this push button start 
aviator means clouds come up on the digital display it looks awesome you also have a nice digital speedometer in there and a bunch of other information when you look up on the windshield you can see that there is a heads up display broadcasting your speed and some other information in there on the steering wheel we do have cruise control now there's nothing lit up here until i press this button and then these light up for your cruise control this does have the semi-autonomous driving system so this can actually steer the steering wheel for you using the lanes on the road and kind of drive for you even going around corners it also has adaptive intelligent cruise control which means it'll slow you down with the vehicle in front of you or if you want can slow and speed you up with speed limit signs as you go past them now the steering wheel also has some features up top. This is for that display up, the digital display up there if you wanna change all those. And this leather wrap steering wheel is heated, feels like a warm cup of coffee first thing in the morning. Got this beautiful floating display right here, which has a hard base navigation system in it. If we press the home button, we can see we have satellite radio and all different ways to listen to this beautiful stereo system. This also has Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, which means if you hook up your smartphone, this becomes your phone, your apps from your phone come up here, your podcast, your Spotify, all that kind of stuff comes up. You can even use the maps from your phone. If we press this button here that looks like a camera, brings around all our camera views and we can change those and look at a bunch of different ways by hitting this menu. I love that front camera for parking. Then if we hit the P button, this is actually how we can either navigate to a parking lot or have the vehicle park for us. And we can have it parallel park us, perpendicular park us, or if somebody really wedges in us in there, we can actually have it pull us out of a parking spot, which is pretty cool. This button here controls a few of the vehicle features. So when we press it, uh, it'll bring up a menu for auto start, stop, auto hold and traction control. Then we have our piano key style shifters, which are really nice for shifting, keeps everything out of the way. This is our controls for our stereo system as well as our climate control, dual climate control, my side, nice big knob for the fan, and then my passenger side here, my heated and air conditioned seats and my heated steering wheel. Come down here, you open up these rollers, you got a place to put things, USB and USB-C connections, and then your cup holders. There's lights in the bottom. What do I love about the lights? Well, there's lights all over this car. There's lights everywhere and even extra storage underneath here. For the lights, if you go into the settings menu, you scroll over, you get to something called ambient lighting. We can have seven different types of lighting, one for every day of the week. If you get bored, you can change it. Then coming down here, electronic park brake, we have some drive modes. What are drive modes? Well, if we change through here, you'll see we can go from normal to conserve or excite. That changes the engine to be either faster or save fuel. If we go the other direction, we can go into slippery or deep snow conditions. And the vehicle's always in all wheel drive, but those two heighten it for different conditions. Big center console, open this up. You got a wireless charger right here. Nice deep places to put things. Come up top, you've got an electrochromatic auto dimming mirror. We've got some nice LED soft touch lighting. And then we've got controls for our power sunroof and power shade. Speaking of shade, put your sunglasses in there. And to top it all off, garage door openers up on the sun visor. That's this beautiful 2023 Lincoln Aviator Reserve. Thanks a lot for watching this video. Do me a huge favor and click subscribe to this channel. Go ahead and hit the bell icon. You'll be notified every time I make a video. If you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. Thanks everyone.